So do you know there's a riskier and a safer way to grab pockets? Knowing the difference can save you from a hand injury, but both positions have pros and cons. The riskier method looks like this, with our outside fingers fully flexed. The advantage of this method is that it can allow us to pull harder, probably because it engages all four tendons connected to the FTP muscle. The downside is that this position creates a shear force on the lumbrical muscles, similar to pulling on a feather in two different directions. We can avoid much of that shear force with the safer method, where our outside fingers are kept more parallel. This can help prevent lumbrical injuries, but the downside is that not engaging those outside fingers as much seems to reduce engagement of the flexor muscle, meaning you won't be able to exert maximum force. So which method should you be using? If you're new to climbing on pockets, start with the safer method at low intensity. If you want to increase your pocket abilities, throw in some progressive pocket training or exposure therapy on or off the wall. And if you want to learn more about this topic, check out our full length videos on YouTube. And that's today's beta.